Hello guys, here's my car. I just got it today. It's got the 1.8 liter dual VVT-I engine, four cylinder, electric power steering. Here's the battery. It's got LED projection lights and then kind of halogen fog lights. It smells brand new. It's just flipped over 112,000 miles. Or, or I mean, not 112,000. 112 miles. See, I'm so used to my old, <laughs> my older vehicles. First new car I've ever got. So, I mean, I've been working hard like to get this house and stuff. So I got this car. I've been working really hard, and I'm very exhausted. It's like 10 o'clock at night. I just got home, and this thing smells like brand new, spanking new. <laughs> Hope, hope it does. It's uh, got 60 inch rims. Uh, this is the, everybody thinks it's a Camry. It's a Corolla 2016 Toyota uh, LE Plus. The LE wouldn't have these rims and the, the touch button radio, I guess. It's white, super white color. It's brand new. Like I said, it only had like 10 miles on it when I got it. Is LE Pro, and that's where I got it at. I'm gonna advertise them. If you want to go get a car there, get it. Pop the trunk, and I'll show you that in a minute. It doesn't have a. It has a camera under there, though. See. Hmm. Just one second here. I gotta get the other key here. 111,000 miles, everybody, I guess. Battery's dead in the key there. There. Probably won't be able to see much now because, you know, it's really dark. But it's got a lot of room in the trunk. There's the backup camera right there. It's standard on all cars now. Trunk door you have to open up inside. I'll do a full in-depth tour later, but there's a lot more room than the other Corollas. It's like a Camry now on the back seats. It's ash color gray seats. Oh boy, that thing smells brand new. 100, ah oh God, I got the focus off there. 111,000 miles. Let's see if I can zoom in there. I was getting 39 miles per gallon on the highway, pushing against the wind. Here, I'll show you this here. I think the radio's on, I hope not. Yeah. Hate that. So, i shut the door here. So I can pair my phone to it here. See if I want to go on my phone, I can do that. And then I got the... Oh, the backup camera when you put it in reverse. It's got the braking thing on there. I don't know what that is for sports mode. Some kind of a brake thing. I don't know, it's like a Jake brake type deal. This is a nice new gear shift lever. It's got your USB and your traction control down there. Your clock up here. And then turn the headlights on. Look at the headlights, that's, that's bright. See it's halogen and LED. And then that's off with the things on. This is what she looks like here. It's got the auto climate control. Everything else, rear defrost. And you can control your climate on here. Let's say if you want to... Let's go back here. Yeah, my cell phone's not on there right now, but car. Here's your average miles per hour, whatever you've been driving, average speed. Um, it shows everything here. It hasn't been reset though, so uh, how do I go back here? Clear. Yes. Uh, like I said, it's it's a lot to get learned <clears throat> to learn yet. Like camera, I can make it brighter, dimmer in the back. 
and then the general like the display if I want it brighter here I kind of want it a little darker at night just a little bit anyway because it's a bright Here's your keyboard and stuff. And I'll start it quick here. Let's get off of this here. Let's just go back to audio. Too bad I can't play audio on on that, but well, it's just a quick startup. But you see how good it starts. 2016 Toyota Corolla. LE plus 111,000 miles. Er, see, there I did again. 111 miles. See, I'm not used to this new car. <laughs> nah. No, I'm not really used to it. I'm, I'm technically not used to any of this stuff. I guess these mirrors flip back and forth for like this. See, you can flip it every direction in case you hit it coming in. That's pretty cool. And uh, I think this is like 138 horsepower. Northern Pride 10 kind of had a problem with it. He doesn't like this engine. So he don't like the CVT transmission. To tell you the truth, the CVT transmission is a lot better than that dual clutch in my Focus. To be honest. So anyway, that's kind of like a little short review of it. Um, I know the vlog's coming out late. I'm going to put this on both my channels, I guess. Because uh, most of my subscribers are subscribed to one channel. And then one's a subscribe to the other channel. So I'll just upload us on both channels. The hell with it, I guess. Alright, well, guys, there she is. She starts good. She runs good. Uh, so far, it's got a nice, nice warranty and stuff. Free oil changes for three years. So it's well worth it. Alright, well, thanks for watching. And don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, and follow me on Twitter for more. And don't wait. Don't forget to for a new video that's coming out like a review and some stuff like in a few miles so I know how it, how I like it and everything. Alright, take care.